Hello Virgo, I hope you're doing well. This is Monica with Pisces Moon Intuitive. Virgo, you want a soulmate reading to check out on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, as usual, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, what you'll be dealing with, facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video whether you're currently in contact with them or not. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Virgo, for Virgo's highest good, please. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Virgo in the life and how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Virgo in the life and how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Extra message. Hmm. You really want to communicate with someone, reach out to someone, but you're not reaching out. It's like you're stopping yourself from reaching out. Hmm. Yeah. This is you feeling stressed. Yeah, something got your attention and it's stressing you out. Yeah, this is how you view your soulmate, the person that you've been dealing with. This is how you view them based on their behavior towards you, kind of in and out of your life, not really present, not really committing in a relationship for some reason. Yeah. Knight of Wands, kind of in and out, not really telling you where this is going or not going. Let's see, Universe, please show us what's coming up for Virgo in the life and how is Virgo currently doing on their summer journey? Ooh, so this person loves you. Yeah, but they haven't told you. They're not really committing to you, but they love you deeply. This is hidden love, unspoken love. They have a lot of pride. They're showing up here as very stoic, not showing that they are emotionally vulnerable. Wow, this has been um, very difficult for you to deal with. You see, for this to show up shows me some kind of a very difficult times you had to go through in this connection, in this relationship. Yeah, you're not taking action right now. This is you not communicating, not reaching out. There's something going on at your job. This is you feeling like maybe you should be somewhere else. Like maybe you don't belong in that environment where you work. You've been waiting patiently to see what this soulmate of yours does. Yeah, this is you trying to balance between your professional life, your work life, and your personal life. Trying to make sense of what's going on and how to proceed correctly moving forward. This is you succeeding at something that has to do with your job. You are excellent at what you do, Virgo. This is you thriving. This is you being talented, resourceful, <clears throat> admired for your accomplishments, for your talents. But it's like you feel you always have to watch your back and defend yourself and protect yourself uh, in that environment. Let me see what's going on here. Then we're going to ask about your soulmate. The universe, please show us what's coming up for Virgo and how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? You feel that you've put effort, time, energy, work into this relationship. It's like you're letting this person go. You are guarding your heart. You are protecting your heart. You also feel very guarded at your job. Your job is showing up for the second time. Like you feel you always have to stand up for yourself and defend yourself and look over your shoulder. <clears throat> Ooh, who is this? Somebody new popping up for you, Virgo. I'm happy for you. 
So the difference between Knight of Wands energy and King of Pentacles, which happens to be my favorite king of all kings, is like night and day difference. This new soulmate is someone who is marriage material, someone who is monogamous, someone who is mature, accomplished. Yeah, beautiful energy. Let's see what's going on with the soulmate you've been dealing with, this Knight of Wands. <clears throat> Universe, please show us. Hmm. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Virgo? <clears throat> And how is that soulmate of Virgo towards Virgo at this time, especially emotionally? The soulmate that Virgo has been dealing with that showed up as Knight of Wands and King of Cups, hidden love, unexpressed love, unspoken love. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with that soulmate of Virgo that Virgo is letting go of at this particular time. <clears throat> So they feel like they need to clear the air with you, communicate with you. This is them trying to figure out how to do this. Yeah, you see, this person hasn't been really communicating with you effectively, trying to, like, they don't tell you how they feel, where this is going, not really making a commitment, kind of putting your life on hold. Yeah, it's like they don't take this connection too seriously for some reason <clears throat> yeah you see this is them knowing that they're gonna have to make a decision and the reason why they are concerned is because they have feelings for you yeah if they didn't have feelings for you they would have let you go already completely yeah this is them trying to balance things in their life also trying to balance their emotions universe wow so we have out of Four twos, we have three of them. Two of wands reversed, two of pentacles, two of swords. The only two that's missing is two of cups. You see, they don't show you that they love you. They don't commit to you. They don't express emotions for some reason. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Virgo. And how is that soulmate of Virgo towards Virgo at this time, especially emotionally? Wow. So this has been a very intense connection between you two with a lot of misunderstandings, breakups, disagreements. This person has a lot of emotional baggage that they need to address from past relationships that they need to release, heal from, forgive address right they very slow to action but they want to come towards you there's something they're not telling you like things are being hidden well one of them is how they feel about you yeah they realize that they love you that they can't just so easily forget you and move on with somebody else yeah you see they realize that things will need to drastically improve for you to let them back into your life again. Yeah, communication, back and forth communication. So they know that communication will have to happen between you two. This is them very curious how you're doing, what you're feeling, what you're thinking. Yeah, so honestly, they're used to this kind of behavior. But they realize that you are different, that you're not going to find this kind of behavior acceptable in your life. No, this is uh, them realizing that you are someone of high quality value. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with that soulmate of Virgo that Virgo has been dealing with. Look how scared they are that they can't let you go because they have feelings for you. This person loves you a lot. Yeah. Yeah, you see, they realize why they lost you. So that's a good sign, right? Because we all make mistakes. Nobody's mistake free. But the good thing is they realize clearly what their mistakes were. The question is, what will they do about them to fix them, right? That's the question. Look how sad they are. Heartbroken, devastated over losing you. Look at this. This is them very sad about losing you. 
Yeah, this is them trying to go within to uh, make wise decisions, to move forward wisely, right? Uh, this is them trying to reflect, to go through um, different scenarios, how to approach this. Wow, heavy reading, heavy energy. Virgo, we're going to go into your extended uh, reading. We're going to ask about this soulmate, but also new soulmate popping up as King of Pentacles, which I absolutely love. I love that energy, King of Pentacles. First, however, we're going to ask about this soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you. What are they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you whether purposely or can communicate for whatever reason but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good and of course at the end we're gonna ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life including new soulmate entering your life the king of pentacles energy new chapters new beginnings in your life also your health finances business job opportunities family matters friendships whatever it is you need to know they'll show it at the end of the reading as well so we'll go click on the extended link below this video in the description box below and i'll see you there love you guys